hello beautiful people welcome back to this wonderful channel it's children's cultural day and you're going to be seeing the whole display from the boys school and yes enjoy the fun guys don't forget to subscribe to this channel support your boys let's go guys now we are moving to the parent street we are starting from the
I'm here to give you a short speech, which will give everyone in this occasion a little enlightenment on what culture is all about. First and foremost, what is culture? Or in other words, how is culture defined? Culture, in simple terms, can be defined as the way of life of an entire society which is passed on from generation to generation. It can also be defined as the ideas, customs, and social behaviors of a particular people or society. Culture can also be said to be the attitudes and behavioral characteristics of a particular social group. This includes codes of manners, codes of greetings, dressing, language, religion, delicacies, art, dance, marriage rights, and so on and so forth. Like you can see, we have various cultures. Like, like you can see, we have various cultures presented before us. The Yoruba culture, Igbo culture, Hausa culture, Ibibio culture, Edo culture, Bainway culture, just to name a few. Secondly, let us briefly examine two major importance of culture in a society. Number one, a sense of belonging. Culture gives a sense of belonging and identity. It builds a strong sense of identity in individuals. Knowing your culture helps you to to identify where you originate from and where your forefathers descended from. It gives you an identity in life. Number two, unification and connection. Culture brings about unity between people of the same cultural heritage. It unites and connects people of similar culture customs and values. It builds friendship. Personally, throughout my experience in life, I have noticed that people of the same culture easily connect and build long-lasting friendships and relationships. And if I may cheat this in, culture determines the school curr curriculum to some extent. Curriculum developers or formulators make educational decisions based on the culture of the society. In closing, there is power in culture. And it's very necessary and important for us to embrace our various cultures because it also promotes peace and harmony in a safe society. Thank you very much, and God bless you all. Thank you much for being pleased for that wonderful explanation of culture. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> yeah.